Okay. Yeah, my research work focuses on switchable power amplifiers for aggressive duty cycling um, to enable significant energy savings. So similar to a car start stop system at a traffic light, the idea is to turn off a power amplifier as often as long as possible uh, to reduce the energy consumption. So in every time gap, we want to turn off the or data gap, we want to turn off the PA. And in this particular work, I'm investigating an integrated V-band power amplifier, so around 50, 60 gigahertz. And here we have a inverse class E topology, so a quite conventional design based on uh, known formulas, but extended with some biasing circuit I labeled Kickstarter here, which first of all provides the active uh, bias to the base, but also uh, speeds up the turn-on phase by this uh, two transistors here operating as an AND gate with the inverter and a delay to create a 150 picoseconds pulse to uh, quickly, uh, for a short amount of time, connect the base of this core transistor here to the supply voltage to speed up the turn-on process. And then when we measure this, and for example, look at the envelope output power, we can see that the signal strength reaches the desired output power within 750 picoseconds, but there's some additional settling time here. Unfortunately, probably because we don't have on-chip termination and then the lab setup, the enable signal causes some reflection. For the turn-off period, we also achieve around 550 picoseconds. And this we can then use for aggressive duty cycling. Uh, maybe to define this term, the idea is to have a very sh short duty cycle interval, so a high duty cycling frequency to minimize the latency. So we can immediately react to new data. And here we have a very short active time. In this example, we only transmit for around 50 nanoseconds. And here this turn on and turn off phase becomes relevant. And here for the first time we measured the energy consumed in this time period. Here it's around 100 picojoule, which we can then use for evaluating how efficient this concept can be. And yeah, besides the usual continuous wave measurements, uh, we for the first time obtained or reported for such a PA turn on time, the energy consumed in such a cycle and the idle power, which becomes interesting if we are inactive for a long time.